reach for the sky, mister. Meet Max, a street urchin at Freeside, who you can find chasing his friend Stacy around with what appears to be a toy. Passing with some caps or passing a speech check reveals that this is in fact Euclid Seafinder, a targeting device for the Archimedes II orbital laser platform, and in theory should be one of the most devastating weapons in the entire Fallout series. But it has one fatal flaw. To use it, you will need to head to Helios 1 and complete the quest that lucky old sun, choosing to direct power to the space laser. Firing it will result in a 5 second delay, but the real kicker is you can only use it once every 24 hours in game, unlike, say, a mini nuke launching Fat Man, which can do similar damage and doesn't rely on the targeting lasers for accuracy. Not only that, but if you chose to arm the Archimedes plant defense system during the quest line, the entire NCR garrison will be killed by a much larger strike than the one from the rangefinder. Which seems strange given the lengths the Brotherhood has still went to acquire it. Still, it does look pretty cool once used, and can be pretty devastating if you manage to line up a strike correctly. Yeah, I guess it works. But how effective do you think Euclid Seafinder really is?